Hey guys, it's your inner chakras. Welcome back to the channel, guys. If you are new, you are welcome, guys. All the information that you need about me is down below. I am doing personals. I'm running a special right now. You can find all that information in Etsy. Um, you can follow me on Instagram and TikTok if you so choose. All right, let's see. What does Spirit have? <clears throat> Guys, I want to thank you for your continued support. Like, there are some of you that commented that you can see that I'm using my hand again and this and that. And then some people said that you've been following me for the past year. You've been following me since day one. Like, I really appreciate you guys. Like, I don't, I don't always get in my feelings, you know. I don't get in my feelings much. But I do cry. I cry. All right, Spirit, what's going on? Y'all make me cry. Y'all just don't see it. I'm not going to cry right now, though, because, you know. <sighs> no, I'm not going to cry right now. <laughs> what's going on? Let's see what Spirit has for you. you spirit. Somebody may be crying in these cards. Let's see what's going on. Hmm. Someone is thinking about not taking this leap of faith with a nine of pentacles. It's like, yeah, they pretty much ended it. Someone decided not to take this leap of faith with this nine of pentacles. It's like they made their decision about it. Um, and they're just, they're headed out on a new path. They're headed out on a new path, right? And they're offering their two of cups to someone else. They are offering their two of cups to someone else. Yes. Yes. I told you somebody was going to cry. It's like there's no new beginnings here and they're just moving on from this nine of pentacles here. It's like they made a decision. To leave this abundant person. Yep. They feel, they probably feel that whoever they're walking away from just gave them a lot of injustice. Like a lot of bad times. There's more bad times than there were good times. Too many fights. Uh, having to fight this person all the time. A lot of issues. Seven of Wands energy. It's like, I don't know if the other person just didn't put in the work, but they definitely learned some lessons there. They're not putting in the work now. It's like, they're just done. They're not putting in the work anymore. This person could have tried to manifest you as a magician, but it didn't work. Maybe you manifested them. Feel free to flip it. But they're choosing to move on. They got the will of fortune. They got, it's like they got a chance to move on. Somebody's moving on from someone else. Guys. Feel free to put the energies. Did I forget to do y'all? Oh, I forgot to do y'all questions again. And I don't know why y'all not reminding me. Yeah, but this person, they're their Knight of Wands energy. The good Knight of Wands, though. They're moving forward fast. They feel like they just made some bad choices here. Yeah, he's, this person here, they're just going to take a knee. They're going to take a knee. And they're always in their head about it. They're always in their head. But they do know that they're moving forward. Just looking at they looking at themselves in the mirror and they're choosing to move forward. Somebody's walking away from something. Mm -hmm. There it is. They're entering to a whole brand new world. Dropping their burdens here. They're leaving their burdens. And this is an executive decision. King of Swords energy. It's like this is what I want to do. They just stopped. Like the King of Swords, they just stopped. The chariot in reverse. They just stopped. And they said no more. 
They said, I'm not happy here. Nine of Cups in reverse. They just stopped. And whoever they're with, they just said, I, I want to be happy. I want to go be happy. And this is hurting someone. Three of Swords energy. They're breaking someone's heart. But your person here, they just have to follow their intuition. They're like, look, I want to go be happy. And whoever they was with, it was a Queen of Cups in reverse. They was with an unloving person. Or this person is just angry right now. Like, they're quite pissed, right? It's like you gave me a rotten-ass Granny Smith apple. So they were in a connection with this person in a higher event. But they're also in temperance. This is the emperor here. They're making a, a decision. They don't want what this person is offering them. And they're not offering this person anything, right? Let's see what's going on here. Let's do Pandora. Let's just hit them a little bit. Because this person is moving on, right? Let's see what's going on here. What is making this person walk away, Spirit? Because this whole reading is about walking away. Completely walking away. Let's see. What's going on here, Spirit? What are the energies here? Like, why are they walking away? They're walking away from personal beliefs and values. Maybe their personal beliefs and values aren't the same. Maybe things change, you know. Oh, unhappily married. Miserable, feeling empty. So this person, they're unhappily married. Yep. They're going to be ending a marriage here. And they say there's miracles all around. So the person trying to change it. They're, they're unhappily married, but they're trying to move on. Somebody is a complainer. I guess whoever they're married to um, is never happy or content. They just complain. They appreciate nothing. And they're inspired. They have hope. They have hope. <laughs> this person has hope to move forward. Anything else, Spirit? This is a fabulous love commitment, guys. This is a committed relationship that they're in, but there's no substance. And it's hard to maintain uh, once the passion fades. So this person went and got into a connection, and then the passion has started to fade, right? And now they're trying to get out. Let's put some Kipper on this, guys. Oh, Spirit. Let's go. All right, guys, there's a military person, a man in uniform. Unexpected Monday. They're probably going to go to court, right? If you go to... Yeah, here's a good lady here. Somebody's working hard. There's a good lady. Holy Spirit. Okay. Gloomy thoughts. So somebody has some gloomy thoughts. What's going on? Yeah, bereavement. There's going to be an ending here with something somewhere. So somebody's in something, which is the person that we've been pulling the energy on. They want to come and talk to you about it. There's been meetings and stuff going on. They want to talk to you about this change that's going on in their life. They're possibly getting divorced. This involves a marriage. I told you. And down here it says they were uh, unhappily married. So this person could be married. You probably don't know that. Yeah. So they're thinking about it. They don't know how to tell you this. They're going to tell you they're in court right now, guys. Ooh, cards. Let's get it. All right. Let's see what else we got. Living room. So you're going to have a conversation in a living room about all of this. Yep. This is a court person. Your person, they're going to court about a marriage that they're ending. It's been a long road for them as well. Mm. Let's see what's surrounding these energies intuitively, right? What's surrounding these energies intuitively? Okay, what's going on here, right? Okay, so 
<laughs> somebody needs to blue pill. Somebody needs to blue pill to get it up. Maybe the blue pill got him in trouble. And what is this? Ooh. Blue pill and tender. So somebody started making, got started taking the damn blue pill, got their dumb asses on Tinder. Mm, and then somebody's walking away. Somebody got caught out there. Yep, and now they watching you. They stalking you. Tinder and what is that damn pill called, guys? What is it called? I'll think about it before I uh, post. This person is drinking a lot too. They drinking a lot. They probably drinking a lot because they can't they can't keep it up. They've been drinking a lot. They can't keep it up. Mhm. Mm <laughs> they busting lemons, right? <laughs> They busting lemons. Take that any way you want. This person loves you. They're going to come in giving you all these lemons, telling you that they love you. They're going through it. I know that much. Yeah, be careful, guys. This person is a spider. They may bite you. It looks like whoever's getting left got caught out there on Tinder. Mm-hmm. They got caught out there. They're going to come and lie to you. These are doggy bones. And a dog that brings a bone carry a bone. So they're going to come to you lying. Your person that's coming to you <laughs> in, under investigation. If they're not under investigation, they should be. Because what's going to happen here is, guys, the person that's coming to you, they're going to tell you that their person cheated for whatever, whatever, whatever. No. The person that's coming to you, they got caught cheating on Tinder because they started taking the Viagra field. I just saw 1212 lost themselves on Twitter. So basically, the Viagra field and Tinder don't mix. <laughs> trouble, trouble, trouble. Woo, honey. What else we got? Yep, look. Told you, this is trouble. My cards don't lie. You best to keep on. Keep on, spirit. I keep telling you, my cards don't lie. Look, and now they don't know what the fuck to do. Episode 11, I think. They all up in the clouds now. They don't know what to do. But they coming to you guys. Be careful. The person that's coming to you got left because they got caught out there. That's an anchor down there. Don't let this person hold you down. Look at this. This is an anchor. Don't let this person come to you, bring you this mess, and hold you down. Yep. Don't let them stop your fly. Whatever it is you're doing. <laughs> Anything else in the Holy Spirit? Yep. Look. Spirit said this is a dead end. That person's going to come and knock in, but know this, guys. They're tendering <laughs> with a blue pill in their system. Okay? Yeah, so the person that come to you, whatever, you heard what I said. <laughs> Thanks for watching, guys. Please like, share, and subscribe. Oh, you know what? Here we go again. Look, I'm so glad I thought of it because y'all going to curse me out down in the comments and I don't have time for it. What are your questions, right? Ask your questions in your head. This would be yes, no, maybe so in regards to your person, whatever, 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 guys. Let's get it. Yes or no, just keep it in your head, whatever you want to know, right? I'm sorry I didn't do these in the last ones. I forget. All right, guys, we go this happily ever after, whatever you're asking. This could be an unlikely, whatever you're asking. This could also be a maybe not, whatever you're asking. Let's get two more. This is a maybe, anything is possible type maybe. One more spirit. What was this? We got another baby, guys. And then we got a true love if anybody wanted to know. Yes. All right, guys. I won't forget these next time. I promise. I promise. I promise. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe. Peace.